For the first time since the beginning of the war, I would like to make a statement in my capacity as a moral philosopher about human beings who are killed during war. And what I want to say is that there's a prejudice we fall into, and it's this. When the numbers of people dead, killed in war, gets above a certain number, we tend to care less about how many it is who have been killed. And there's something wrong with that. And what's wrong with it is that numbers matter ethically. What I mean by this isn't that there is some philosophical theory that tells us that killing more people is worse than killing few people, that utilitarian philosophies argue for this. No, I'm not saying that. What I'm saying is that killing 10 people is a crime 10 times worse than killing one person. What I'm saying is that ethically we have to insist, and it's politically constructive for us to insist, on it being the case that when the Russians kill a thousand Ukrainians, that's a crime 10 times worse than the crime, the appalling crime of killing a hundred Ukrainians. Numbers ethically matter. This is because every human life is real and every human life matters equally. This hasn't been something that human beings used to think in the past. But one of the features of the modern world, that's to say the Western world over the last three centuries, but also much of the rest of the world, one of the central features, maybe the central feature of the way we ethically relate to the world over the last two or three hundred years is that we think that each person is of equal moral worth and that this is as fundamental an ethical feeling as anything that we have got. And that's why, actually, modern slavery has seemed so abhorrent to us, because we already knew better. We felt like we knew better. And that's why I want to say that during war, we often lose perspective when we move from 5,000 to 10,000 to 20,000 to 50,000 dead. But each number matters. Harry and Susan and Ricky and Samantha are all people whose lives are real. And whether two of them are killed or four of them are killed makes a world of difference. What's the difference? Well, the difference is that out of the four, two live. That's a world of difference. And that's why numbers matter. Numbers during war matter. And the more people you kill, the ethically worse your predicament is. And numbers matter such that a thousand dead is always twice worse than 500 dead, 10 times worse than a hundred dead. A hundred times worse than ten dead. A thousand times worse than one dead. That's something we've got to insist on because we get anesthetized and start feeling that when numbers cross a certain level, it's all equally as bad. And I think it's super healthy to say, no, it's not.